This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Thursday, the 3rd of August. We're looking at the Dow down 95 at 35,189, a quick 500-point drop from the 35,678 high of just three days ago. <clears throat> we did make a peak F. I'll talk about that in, in the show coming up. But there are a lot of things going on. That nine-period moving average has turned down, but it's not even close to crossing negative. So don't think about below the 14-period moving average. There can still be bounces, a whole bunch of things. It's a process. It's not one of those single um, Eiffel Towers, straight up, straight down turnarounds that we've got. But we are making lower lows and lower highs in the very short term. S&P, same thing. S&P made a high of 4507 about five six sessions ago. <clears throat> Now at 4499, down 14 points. That nine period moving average is getting closer to turning down, uh, uh, crossing negative, but it's not negative yet. QQQ, same thing, very close, much closer. Down 31 cents at 374.11, 387.98 was the high in LA July. IWM, the Russell 2000, peak F top at 198.75, uh, four sessions ago, trading down $1.18, now at 193. Gold, gold tries every every day is trying to rally, but it fails. It's down six dollars at nineteen sixty nine, and is now below. It closed below the two hundred period moving average yesterday. Is down again below it. That means the dollar is attempting to go a little higher. Yep, it's gone a little higher in leg D. It's stretching this leg D, but it's not a very strong uh, move in terms of the left side high that it has to challenge, which is up in the hundred and threes. So it's at one hundred two seventy right now. Crude oil, whoa, -ho, crude oil. Um, had a sharp pullback yesterday, trying to come back today. It's up 86 cents at 80.36. Bonds, I tell you something, this is the deterioration in the speed that the bonds have tumbled to the downside, makes it a low that was made back in the monthly chart. I'm looking at 90.91.85 back in October of last year. That's going to be the, the challenge. Are we going to get there? Wow, it looks like we are going to get there at some point pretty soon. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. Check out my opening call, Daily Newsletter. See you in a few moments.